Hello everyone and welcome back to another GTA Online guide where today we're going to be taking a look at the Barrage, a fast attack combat car added as part of the Doomsday Heist DLC, so let's get right to the guide shall we? So for the price of 2.1 million undiscounted you get a truck that comes with a machine gun mounted on the top front and one on the back. Customization options allow you to upgrade the front machine gun with a minigun and the rear machine gun with either a minigun or a grenade launcher. I personally chose to have the rear mounted minigun mainly because I'm not really a fan of grenade launchers. Anyways, besides the mounted weapons, this car has a lot of visual upgrades that you can choose from. This is probably the most customizable vehicle in the DLC, and I like the large variety of options that are available. None of them seem to enhance the defences of the vehicle, so I would just say go with what you think is the most visually pleasing to you if you decide on getting one of these. And yes, I would recommend you grab one of these as even without the engine upgrades, because I couldn't afford them, this thing is pretty fast and easy to control. Definitely a car that you can rely on to get you the hell out of there in a pinch if the situation arises. The top mounted machine gun has a full 360 range of aiming whereas the rear mounted weapon is limited to a 160 degree aim angle. So make sure you orient the car in the best position if you want both of your gunners to be able to attack effectively. Defence wise this car has fantastic explosive defence. With CGH at the wheel the truck was able to withstand 5 direct hits from a rocket propelled grenade. So this thing will offer you great protection if you find yourselves against a tank or something. Don't rely on it to protect you against bullets though, as even with the most enclosed panels for the doors and other panels, bullets were able to penetrate through just fine and deal damage to the driver. Overall, this is a slightly less protective version of an insurgent, just with an extra weapon bolted on the top of it. Let me know what you guys think about this thing in the comments, and hey, if you enjoyed this short video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the Pyron Gaming channel for loads more videos coming to you very soon. See you around, everyone.